Hey guys, it's Monday morning, so I thought I would share with you everything that sold on the weekend. So I had about 14 orders total, um, but one of those orders actually has eight books in it, which I was really, really happy about because I love multi-orders. Um, so I will get into that in a second. Please make sure you subscribe and like the video if you indeed like it so I can keep creating more and more for you guys. All right, let's go. Alright, so I got one book to go and of course it is in Bookbox C, which is this bottom one. You guys were sitting on top of that, so I will get the last book out and then I will show you guys all the books that sold this weekend. And of course, after printing the labels, I got one more order. It is always the way, always the way, but I got that one out too, so I will show you that. All right, so I had one little problem. Um, so this one is the one that just came through and I need um, to print a label from, so that's fine. This one was the eight books. I thought I would be able to fit it into a medium mailer, mailer um, but I've had to fit it into a large mailer. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cancel the original shipping label and so I'll get a refund for that one and then I'll get a large one. So I will lose a little bit of money because I did only charge her medium. Um, that was my own fault. I should have come down, tried putting them all in the mailer or just overcompensated and said the large. So that was my fault, but oh well. Um, so these are the rest of them all here. I almost forgot to put the express um, post tape on them. Um, the express post one. So I got this for free from the um, post office as well. So if you get some express post ones, it's good to put this tape on it, at least in a couple of spots so it doesn't get mixed, missed. Oh my god, I can't speak this morning. It's definitely a Monday morning. Um, so yeah, I'm going to print off the labels for these two, then I'm going to head off to the post office and then I'm going to come back and press and photograph some more books. I've got to finish up this pile, which I didn't finish on the weekend. My studio is just a bit of a mess at the moment. And if you can see down there, there's a messy pile of books. Um, so, books, 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 books. And then we got books, and I just took these ones over, so that was my fault. And then I've just got these boxes of books as well. So, it's locked down at the moment as of, um, when was it? Saturday. It's Monday now. So I'm glad I got the them all on Thursday and Wednesday. Um, because at least I have stuff to do during lockdown. Otherwise, I would be running out of books for you guys all. So that's all from me today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you liked it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And on the next video, I actually want to go through how you can get the cheapest shipping. Um, so what I do is definitely not the cheapest way for some of my items, but it's just the easiest way. And I'm not sure whether I want to change that or not, but I'm going to run through all the different ways that you can post items and what might be the best deal for you. All right. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.